Hey, welcome to Cosmic Tides. We're going to see how the cosmic currents are pulling for Taurus. This is going to be your beginning to middle of September spread. Down below, I will have the timestamp if you want to skip past my talking. Links for my Spotify, Apple Music, and Instagram will be down below, as well as my email for $20 personal readings. Due to a high volume of requests, I need at least 2-3 days to get them done after transaction, so I appreciate you for your patience. Also, I am so excited to announce my new single, Enjoy the Ride, is now on all major platforms, so definitely go check that out. And we hit 5,000 subscribers, so keep checking back because I will be doing a 5K giveaway video showing you guys how to enter, what I'm giving away, and all that good stuff. And I just really want to say thank you guys so much for tuning in with me every week. Thank you for liking, sharing, subscribing, donating, and leaving me such beautiful comments. I really appreciate you guys being a part of this journey with me, and I'm glad we got to build this up together. So thank you guys so much. And keep in mind these energies are interchangeable. This could be you, your partner, whoever. This definitely could be a vice versa reading for some of you okay okay so let's get started so what I'm seeing is I see your dreams are coming true and I see people are watching so it's like for some of you you may have like a platform I see you have like an audience here people are like watching you for others I'm seeing it's like you're doing really good and you could be connecting with somebody here and I see this person is watching you like kind of stalking you watching you okay and I see you're wanting to buckle down and really get things done for yourself like career-wise and I'm seeing, yeah, you're in a little bit of an inner conflict here. I see you have an inner conflict, okay? Because I see, um, yeah, it's also like, it's like you're being asked to go down this path of the unknown. For a lot of you, it's like I'm seeing a business or something. It's like a new business idea I'm seeing. Or this is like just something new, a new endeavor I see you going for. You could have a job and you're wanting to start a side business or something like that, okay? And it's like... Whatever you're doing, people are watching. I see things are looking really good for you. And it's like, I see you taking, I see you going down this path of the unknown. And it's kind of scary because I'm seeing your third eye and your chakra and your, well, your third eye and your crown chakra are out of alignment. Okay. So I definitely see it's like, you're not sure what's going to happen next. And that gives you a lot of inner conflict is what I'm seeing. Okay. But you're being asked to know that you are ready, you have the resources and ability to manifest your most best life here, okay? But I'm seeing it's like you have these fears that are actually coming from your root chakra of like uncertain self-employment. There's fears around money and for some of you it's like, I see it's like you're connecting with a person as well, okay? So I see it's like you're also concerned about the stability of that situation as well. So I definitely see you're concerned about something here. Um, I definitely see you can benefit from balancing out your root chakra. It's causing a lot of fear and worry here. As well as your third eye, your crown, your throat. Yeah, your throat. Like, as soon as I dealt out your cards, I said I had, like, a coughing attack. And, then like, if you can't tell, I'm, like, jumbling over my words. So, definitely your throat chakra needs to be balanced here. As well as your heart chakra. I see a lot of green in here. So, definitely would benefit from that. Um... <clears throat> yeah, definitely would benefit from that, as well as your sacral chakra. I'm seeing a lot of orange in here, okay? So definitely be mindful of that. I'm also seeing some yellow, too. So yeah, your solar plexus. And I'm also feeling that it's almost like, um, it's like when your solar plexus is off, that messes with your self-esteem, okay? Paired with your root chakra giving you a lot of fears and worries, and then it's like, your um, third eye is all blocked up because of these two as well. So it's like, you, it's hard for you to see what's going to happen next. And it's like, it's scary. It gives you a lot of inner conflict. But you're being asked to know, relax, okay? Don't be worried. You, you're ready for this. Whatever the universe is throwing at you right now, just trust that you are ready. You are built for this, okay? But yeah, I'm just seeing there's a lot of fears concerning a stability of a relationship and stability of a business I'm seeing, okay? But I'm seeing or being asked to realize, um, yeah, this is a contented, rewarding family life. Emotional material needs are met, okay? You're being asked to stick your head up out of the water, okay? Because this is just a perception right now. Because I'm seeing in reality, I see it's time for you to take action. I see you being fearless and happily pursuing your most treasured dreams. And I see you walking into a new um, a new chapter full of amazing career opportunities, okay? I'm seeing delays are over. I see sudden unexpected good luck for you, okay? For some of you, I see you traveling, okay? And I'm just seeing it's like you're choosing to let go of your worry and fear, 
because it's like yeah it's like you know that you have this blindfold on it's no it's like you know you're not you're not able to see what's going to happen next you know that you don't know what the fuck's happening next and it's like because of that it's like you're choosing not to worry about it and i just see you letting it go to the universe you're letting it go so you don't have to worry about it because it's like you have this blindfold on so it's like you can't see what's going to happen anyway right so it's like you're just trusting the universe to um steer you in the right direction i'm seeing okay and i'm seeing abundance things are looking really good for you even though it doesn't feel that way you're being asked to have patience at this time make long-term plans for yourself okay but it's like i really like this energy though it's like yeah it's like you're aware that your chakras are messing up yeah it's like your chakras um being out of alignment is messing up like how you're feeling and putting all these fears worries doubts in your head here messing up your your crown chakra your third eye you can't see what's happening next and instead of continuing to worry about it you're just like you know what i'm just giving this to god the universe whatever you believe in it's like i'm just giving this to the universe i'm gonna be okay I'm, I'm not gonna worry about this so like that's what i really see happening right now okay and you guys will definitely benefit from balancing out your chakras definitely i encourage you to use the internet find different ways that work best for you a lot of you um it's like eating foods is very beneficial uh, beneficial yeah eating eating healthy foods are very beneficial to you especially if they're color coded to your chakras it's going to help you balance out a lot easier a lot of you um frequencies music um look up online like heart chakra healing music stuff like that okay it's definitely going to help you balance yourself out and then it's also like because of this it's like now you're being mindful because it's like now you know why you're having all these negative thoughts all this fear all this fogginess it's because of your chakras as well as the planets too i'm seeing is affecting this it's like planets move chakras move okay and then our manifestation becomes a little bit off our perception becomes off okay so definitely be mindful of that which i am seeing you do over here it's like you know it's like i'm not going to be able to see through this fog right now um there's some things in the dark right now that's all I'm, that's all as well as what i'm seeing there's some things in the dark right now They're, they will be illuminated just not right now it's part of the bigger picture here so just trust in the universe in divine timing basically okay and just like give the universe all your stress all your worries okay because i am seeing like wonderful news worth celebrating coming into you coming for you okay <clears throat> And I'm seeing things will be illuminated. Things in the dark will be brought to light here. So everything is going to be making sense very soon. Probably by the next full moon I'm seeing. Okay. Um, I'm seeing, yeah, positive changes are on the way here. A welcomed relief from troubled times. I see you getting blessings after the burdens that you were just dealt. Which I also see happening um, in the first two cards too. Unexpected good luck. Amazing career opportunities. News worth celebrating. I see you getting blessings from the burdens that you were already dealt with. And it's like, all that stuff is confirmation, but it's because your perception's off. It's like, it's not really feeling that way. So it has, excuse me, so it has like a little bit of like a scariness because it's like, you don't know what to expect next, like I said. But it's like, yeah, it's like you don't know what to expect next. But it's like, once you realize like, you know what, there's no fighting this. I'm feeling this way for a reason. This is temporary. I'm just giving this to the universe. It's like, then that's when these blessings all start happening even more. And that's when things start really coming into place. It's like when you realize that you need to let go of feeling like you're missing out, feeling like you're lacking, feeling like you're missing an opportunity, feeling like um, life just keeps happening to me. Life doesn't happen for me. That's really what I'm seeing here. It's like once you choose to release that feeling, those low vibrational thoughts, those low vibrational feelings, once you just choose to give up your control on this situation and just trust that the universe is taking you through the right course at the right time, doing things in your best favor, even if it may not feel like it at the time, it's like I am seeing major, major blessings happening it's like you just got to let go of control so the universe can take the wheel basically okay i might name your video that because i am seeing as like for a lot of you you're being asked to raise your vibration bring fun into everything that you do okay um when you expect greatness you get greatness have fun um raise your vibration here okay um use the law of attraction in your favor here 
okay? Because what I am seeing is for some of you, especially who are like who have a job and are wanting to start up this side business, whatever you're doing, it's looking really good. I see um, you have an exceptional talent for multitasking here. So it's looking really good for you, okay? I see you choosing to follow your passions when it comes to your career. And I see you being compensated for your creative talents, all right? So I really love that energy here. And yeah, you're being asked to um, not back down from what you believe you're supposed to do, what you believe you deserve, whether that's um, a person or your career I'm seeing, okay? Because you're really coming into your own. I see you really continuing to move forward, but it's like I'm seeing, it's like something, it's like something, and oh, it's the your root shocker. So you keep getting these fears and these doubts that kind of just pop into your mind here. It's like, yeah, you're continuing to move forward, you're really coming into your own, but then you have something like a little little negative voice in your head that says like, hey, you can't do this, or hey, this isn't going to work, or blah, 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 blah. So it's like definitely be mindful of that little fearful voice coming from your root chakra, okay? Because it's like all up in your head, basically, all up in your head, because I am seeing again confirmed you're getting good karma the good you do comes back to you okay and i'm seeing an unexpected inflow of money for you okay and i see yeah for some of you you're going back to school i see some of you um are like public speakers education in the form of seminars some of you are getting new apprenticeships i'm just seeing you have excellent craftsmanship and i see you starting long-term projects that are going to be successful okay yeah i see you being rewarded rewarded for all your hard work okay you're going to be rewarded from all these bless uh all these burdens that you've been through you're going to be rewarded this is your good karma coming back to you okay so definitely um look at this in a fresh set of eyes here because i'm seeing you are going to be happily successfully self-employed i see cherishing your alone time okay i see actually you could be holding yourself back from somebody and creating a stalemate with them pretending like there's no problem Okay, and it's like, yeah, because you're placing too much importance on material items, so you definitely could be focusing too much on work here and holding yourself back from somebody because you're worried you're going to lose it, placing too much of an importance on material items. You might have uh, Aquarius in your chart. This was very similar to the Aquarius one again. And yeah, I'm just seeing um, you're really wanting to take a leap of faith towards this person, and I just see you taking a leap of faith, uh, a leap of faith towards this person. I see you following your dreams into a lot of unexpected new opportunities. So I see that. And for a lot of you too, it's like, it's like you just have like this, yeah, you just get caught up in fear and worry and doubts. So it's like you doubt yourself a lot, but I see you taking control of your life. I see you following your dreams, taking this leap of faith to just do it. And um, I really like that energy here. So yeah. It's looking really good overall for you. It's just your perception is off because your chakras are out of balance here. Um, and that's because of the planets, and that's fine. And for some of you, it's because of what you're eating, I'm seeing. Okay, so definitely be mindful of that. Um, definitely start that now to just make it a smoother transition into September. That way you can actually enjoy the abundance that's all around you. Because this is also like telling me too for you guys. Like you need to um, really look at the abundance that's around you. Look at what you should be grateful for. Because I'm seeing you guys have so much abundance and love surrounding you guys. And it's like you're taking it for granted here. Um, yeah, you're taking it for granted here. And you are being asked to release that. Release that so you can fully enjoy this moment. So you can fully enjoy your life. Because I am seeing so many good things happening for you. Um, it's just like you got to open your eyes to it. you got to change your perception so you can see it. So you can claim it and feel it. Because it's also, that's going to bring us more of that. It's the law of attraction, right? So definitely do that. It will help benefit you guys. Um, yeah, it's it looks really good for you. Overall, it looks really good for you. Lots of good karma coming for you, even though it doesn't feel like it. Like, your perception is really off here. So definitely get that checked out. <laughs> um, so you could be dealing with a Cancer or a Pisces, and a Gemini, Aquarius, a Taurus, a Virgo, an Aries. You could be dealing with um, another Pisces, yeah. Um... I see a lot of Earth here, so definitely it could be Capricorn, Virgo, um, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, another Taurus, definitely could be, 
Um, lots of water here too. Pisces for sure. Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. Yeah, definitely could be a Cancer here. Like I said, definitely go check out the Aquarius reading because that might help you like fill in the blanks. Because it sounds like very, very similar again. Um, let's see. And yeah, just like balance out your chakras. That's going to really help you in this situation. It's going to benefit you. And um, I'm just going to leave that there. Make sure you guys are checking back at the channel. I will be posting up the 5K giveaway video showing you guys how to enter, what I'm giving away, and all that good stuff, okay? All right, thanks for tuning in. See you next week. Bye.